California Senator Kamala Harris, who is poised to be the first female vice president of the United States, has accomplished a lot over the course of her very successful career. But before she decided to really dive into California politics, Harris was briefly known in certain circles for something other than her knack for public policy, dating Montel Williams, the famed daytime talk show host. More than a decade later, Harris and her future husband, Doug Emhoff, were set up on a blind date. At the time, Harris was already California's attorney general. Less than one year after their first date, the two were married in a courthouse wedding in August 2014. Harris also became a stepmom to Emhoff's children from another marriage, Cole and Ella, and they've been a happy family ever since. In fact, Harris has said of all the titles she's had in her life, there's one that stands above the rest. Vice President will be great. But Mamala will always be the one that means the most. In a 2019 essay for Elle, Harris wrote of her stepchildren, Cole and Ella could not have been more welcoming. They are brilliant, talented, funny kids who have grown to be remarkable adults. I was already hooked on Doug, but I believe it was Cole and Ella who reeled me in. However, before all that, Harris was on the dating scene with some pretty high-profile people. The couple was spotted on the red carpet with William's daughter, Ashley, at the 2001 Race to Erase MS in Los Angeles. At the time, Harris worked for the San Francisco City Attorney's Office. A picture of the three at the event ran in both Ebony and Jet magazines, with both outlets identifying her as William's girlfriend. According to the Daily Mail, the relationship didn't last very long. However, when the old pic of them on the red carpet resurfaced during Harris's campaign, Williams went on social media to address the news. He wrote, Kamala Harris and I briefly dated about 20 years ago when we were both single. So what? I have great respect for Senator Harris. I have come to wonder if the same stories about her dating history would have been written if she were a male candidate. Lest you think it's an unlikely pairing, Vice President-elect Kamala Harris and Montel Williams might have bonded over a shared love of politics and serving their country. According to the Daily Mail, Williams spent almost a decade in the Navy before he got discharged in 1989, and then he was on the reserves for another seven years. More recently, he shared his thoughts on President Donald Trump, some of which Harris might agree agree with, even if she might not be so blunt on a debate stage. Williams called the president's treatment of the press a violation of the Constitution, and he questioned Trump's attitude toward the military. He told Variety, This is the first commander-in-chief that I believe doesn't recognize what his role is and doesn't understand that they're not pawns on a chessboard. He's responsible for their lives. I don't believe he understands that, never has understood that, so I'm not really that much of a believer in his relationship other than the fact that he likes people to stand up, salute, and say, aye aye sir. While Harris and William share a passion for politics, Harris found her true soulmate in her husband, Doug Emhoff. And fortunately, Emhoff supports his wife wholeheartedly. He talked to Marie Claire in 2020 about her 2019 decision to run for president. She made that decision, and I would have supported whatever she decided. But I'm not her political advisor, I'm her husband. And so my role was to be there for her, to love her, to have her back, to talk it through, to help her. Harris ended up losing her presidential bid, but in November 2020, she became vice president-elect alongside president-elect Joe Biden. As for Williams, he found love with former flight attendant Tara Fowler. The couple married in 2007. Williams sang Fowler's praises after his stroke in 2018, telling people, She literally slept in a cot beside me every day for 21 days. Didn't complain once. Every doctor, every nurse that walked in the room had to go through her to get to me. It sounds like both Williams and Harris have been lucky in love and ended up with perfect partners. Check out one of our newest videos right here. Plus, even more Nikki Swift videos about prominent public figures are coming soon. Subscribe to our YouTube channel and hit the bell so you don't miss a single one.